Hello to all of you. This is Dr. Tawal Mehta, and today we will try to understand how to do the prediction for the new data set with the help of new bias in RapidMind. So, the new bias classifiers are a family of simple probabilistic classifiers based on applying Bayesian theorem with strong independence assumptions between these features. They are among the simplest Bayesian network models but coupled with kernel density estimation. And because of this, they achieve the high accuracy levels. Now, how we can predict for the new data set? Let us see in rapid mind. For this, I'll have to go in the process area. First of all, I'll activate the hard data set. I'll connect this plan with the result field. I'll press the play button. So here, the attributes which are there are age, gender, chest pain type, resting blood pressure, cholesterol, fasting years, resting ECG, max HR, exercise, old pick, ST slope, and heart disease. Now, on the basis of these attributes, I want to classify that a patient is having a heart disease or not. So I will again go in design window and I'll select the attributes. Now it is now it may be possible that in your data set you may be having many attributes, but to create a model you want to discard some of them. Therefore, you will go in select attributes, you will activate the subsetting select attributes and you will only select those attributes which are matter of your interest so age cholesterol fasting bs heart disease old pain and resting blood pressure apply now i'll set the row I'll simply drag it and drop it. I'll activate the heart disease and make it sure that the target role is labeled. Next thing which I have to do is cross validation. I'll drop this call cross validation here. At present, disconnect this plug. Now, when, you when any operator is having two years, it means that there is a sub-process which is there. Or rather, parent process and child process is there. So, what you will have to do? You will have to double-click on it. And now, you will connect new bias here. Drag it. Connect training with the training. Model with model. An example with the display. Again, go here, apply the model. Connect model with model, test with unlib. Activate the performance indicator, operator, performance operator, and select the performance operator which is related to the classification part. Connect label with label. Here, performance with performance, example with test. Now, when all splines are connected, press up and and you will come on the main window where the main processes are run. Now, I will enter the new data set. This data set. Now, the model has never seen this data set because it is completely new data set. I will select all the three processes, right click, copy, control V. Now, I will connect this select attributes. I'll write down apply the model. So I'll drop it here. Now basically this model which has been created with the help of cross validation will enter into this model. The new data set will enter into the unlabeled. Label will go into the result. The model will go into the result. I'll press the play button. I'll directly go into the example set. And you can see here the prediction which has been done by the algorithm. And this is the original raw data. And this is the prediction done by the algorithm. And what is the confidence level? For yes, a person is having a heart disease. The confidence is very low. And no, it is 0.949. So here, 
the classification has been done accurately here the misclassification is there so for more videos on right rapid minor kindly subscribe to my channel you can follow me on linkedin and twitter please refer my playlist in which i have uploaded many videos of rapid minor you don't forget to press the like button